Tomorrow marks one month since Paul Cochu went missing. Since he was last seen, you can see volunteers and firefighters here today searching along the Monongahela. And with them, they have these maps, which divides the area into a grid to try and find any clues. Mike's team, you're going up river. Another week, another search. I will be here every Wednesday and Thursday until Paul is found. Every Wednesday, Paul's cousin, Craig McLaughlin, makes the five and a half hour drive from New Jersey, hoping this week will be different, hoping this week they'll find something. We come out here and we make the best efforts we can to find anything, any little thing, any little piece of information that may help. But on that long drive home, five and a half hours, it's, it's pretty solace um, because we still have no answer. Despite the lack of clues, searching has not slowed. Dozens of volunteers showed up today, including volunteer firefighters from Munhall. After hearing McLaughlin, who is an EMT back in New Jersey, needed help, they stepped up. It's a brotherhood, it's a family. He reached out, said, hey, we're willing to help. Whatever you need, we'll, we'll support you, and that's what happened. Helped with many other searches, but being my own family, that's where you have to put the most strength you have and believe in your good faith. That something will happen and you will you will find the answers you need. Paul's family says they hope that dive teams can come out here and search the Monongahela this weekend as long as conditions are okay. They say the tips are still coming into the police, and if you know anything about what happened to Paul, call 911. Reporting from the South Side, Courtney Fisher, Pittsburgh's Action News 4.